Hello and welcome to this video. Today we're going to solve a question from 2017 past paper on vector geometry. Our question reads, in the diagram below, vector OP is equals to 2P and vector OQ is equals to 4Q. And we've been given the ratio PX to XQ is equals to 1 to 2. Our first question, express in terms of Q and or Q. So our first question is asking us to find the vector PQ. And for us to find vector PQ, the best route we can take is P, O, and O, Q. So for us to find the vector PQ, the best route we can use is moving from O to, from P to O and from O to Q. And our vector P, O, since it's moving against the arrow, our vector will be a negative. So it will be a negative O P plus O Q. Our O Q will still be a positive since it's moving in the same direction as the vector. And our vector O P will be a negative 2 P plus 4 Q. That's our vector. But the best way to write it is to begin with the positive part, which is 4Q minus 2P. Now, our second question is asking us to find the vector PX. And for us to find the vector PX, in the previous question, we found the vector PQ. And we've been given the ratio PX xq which is px to xq is in the ratio 1 to 2 which is 1 to 2 and it's giving us a total of 3 so if we divide pq by 3 we are going to get equal 3 equal parts and one of those 3 equal parts is px so for us to find px we're going to divide pq by 3 so it will be pq over 3 and then in our previous question we found pq to be 4q minus 2p then we divide everything by a 3 then our question the third the question is asking us to find the vector ox and the best route we can take is op and px our vector px, we found the vector px, and we have, we've been given the vector op. So it will be op plus px, and our op is 2p plus our vector px that we found to be 4q minus 2p over 3. We cannot just end here, but we'll proceed by finding the lowest common denominator between the two, that would be over 1. Our lowest common, common denominator would be a 3. Then 3 into 1 into 3 should give us a 3. Then 3 multiplied by 2p which should give us a 6p plus 3 into 3 which is a 1. Then 1 multiplied by that top part which should give us a 4q minus 2p. In this case, we've got common, something that's common, which is that like terms. So we subtract, okay, we first collect the like terms, 6p minus 2p plus 4q over 3. Then our 3p, uh, 6p minus 2p giving us a 4p plus 4 Q over 3. You can just end there. So we proceed by reading this question. Given that OC is equals to HOX, show that CQ is equals to 4 open bracket 1 minus H over 3 close bracket Q minus 4H over 3 P. Yep. So 
we've been asked to show that CQ, this vector CQ is equal to this. And then for us to find the vector CQ, the best route we can take is CO then OQ. So our movement will be C O plus O Q. Then in our question we're taught that O C O C is equals to H O X. And in the previous questions that we solved, one of them were asked to find the vector O X. And so we're going to first find the vector O C, which is that. We just have a side work here, which is OC is equals to HOX in our. So we replace the vector OC, which would be H open bracket 4P plus 4Q over 3. That's the vector we had as our. Um, then our vector OC is equals to H O X. And then our O X, we found our vector O X to be that. And then we we'll multiply H throughout. And that will be 4 H P plus 4 H Q over 3. So we found that to be our vector O C. Since we found our vector OC and we've been told that CQ is equals to CO plus OQ, we've only found the vector OC, but in this case, we're looking for CO, which is against this vector. So, by it being neg uh, against this vector, we're going to move in the negative way, which will be a negative um o c plus o q a negative o c our o c is that so multiply negative by that which is 4 h p plus 4 h q over 3 which is that plus our o q which is a 4 sorry sorry it's a 4 q then a negative multiplied by everything there, which would be a negative 4HP minus 4HQ over 3 plus 4Q. Then we can separate these two by saying negative 4HP over 3 minus 4h q over 3 plus 4 q then we'll collect the like terms which will begin with the that one and that one a pos uh, like terms but we'll begin with the positive one which will be a 4 q minus 4 h q over 3 minus 4 h B over 3. This part was simply going to factorize what's common in that, which is a 4, then say open bracket 1 minus h over 3, close bracket, and our vector, since it's common in both, it will be outside there. Then minus 4 h over 3 vector b. Hence, shown.